Yo, this is Straight Edge 85 here, and I'm going to be explaining how to get the Golden Sport. You just seen that? I just had this. You have the tomahawk, the pitcher, that poster right there, which I will be explaining later. And then you go in here, and then you just zap the spork that's on the ground. You'll see it. Trust me. And then when you hear the demonic laugh, that means you have got it. All right. So I'm going to be speeding this up a little bit here. But now the next thing you're going to need is the first thing you're going to need is that tomahawk. So I get that first. And you're going to have to have gone on the plane at least once before doing this. Alright, and now you're going to need the acid gat. Alright, so this is just a free one. One of my friends helped me get it, but I do not take credit for it. And now, now you need to upgrade this gun to the acid gat. And then you just have to follow my instructions from there. Alright, so give you a second. Uh, I'll tell you what's important next. So now, we need to head to the cafeteria. We need to go to the cafeteria and tomahawk. Well, first, that spork you did, now you gotta press X or square if you have PlayStation 3. And just go to this bathtub that's in the infirmary, and there you go. You'll, you'll hear in the little notification. Now, now that you're in the cafeteria, you go to that back window that we were just at, right next to the uh, building table, the craft table. Yeah, that window that we just passed again. Then you're gonna take that tomahawk and look straight to your left when you're there, like in, back in the window. You're going to look at that little TV tray thing, and then you're just going to throw your tomahawk right at it. There's another spork there. Come up here, press X on the tub. And yet, yeah, now, you know, this is just us trying to speed it up a little bit. We're just moving off now. Yeah. Eh. By now, just keep paying attention, people. I'm sorry that this is going to be a little bit rough going through, but just bear with me. Now, now we just need to work on getting the acid gap parts. If you know where they are, good for you. Congratulations. Now just go up. We just built in the cafeteria. Sick. But now you go to the cafeteria. You uh, go get the acid gas. As soon as I get it here, I'll tell you when I get it. This is as fast as I can make it go. I'm sorry. So we're just gonna pass the time here. Yeah. And trying to escape. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yep. All right. Let's see. Come on. Speed it up. Come on. Oh my gosh! Boring! Wait in here! It's time! What the hell? Okay, just, just bear with me. It took me a few rounds. It took me a round to just to get all the parts and just survive. Try to revive people. Yeah, we're part of a group known as Zero. We uh, help each other out when it comes time to. And we really just work together here, we're mostly, I'm a, I'm a zombie player myself, so my gamer tag's right up there. Yeah, one of the Asagats parts were in the warden's office, alright? Just let you guys know, if whoever did not know, I did not know where the other parts are right now. Oh yeah, and if you did not know this already, the Tomahawk can grab her. If you did not know that already, but most of you probably did. Mwah! Now, all right. So now, if everyone wants that golden spork, they have to they have to all go over here and get that little TV tray to the left, not to the right where I threw mine. But yeah, mine I already did it already. So yeah. Now, we hear, now see we did that. We killed some people with the thing. Now we come back up here and stir it with the other spoon. Yeah, we had to wait for everybody to do it. So. After you do it, if you do it on solo, you can just do it like that. Get some kills in there afterwards doing it, then you just gotta go up there to the tub and stir it. Now, what you're gonna need to do now is actually do the upgrade to Acid Gat. Now, you don't have to upgrade it or pack a punch it. Pack a punch the Acid Gat, all you need to do is have the Acid Gat, but it, it's really helpful doing it with pack a punch. Okay. Now, we're about to upgrade soon enough. Just give a, just bear with me here. Alright, now this is just me scoundering for the other part now. Like I said, I put a little info ahead of time, but here, here's where the part was. It was right in front of Speed Cola. See, it was right there. Yeah. It can be anywhere in there, but now we go hurry up. Uh, I had to run to the cafeteria because this is where my friends told me to build it. Now we, I'm running all the way there, hurrying up, hurrying up, hurrying up, and run. Now I'm building it. 
Now I'm upgrading the acid to the acid gas. Now, now we're gonna have to wait around or two or two because we're about to take the plane again. Because we just felt like it at the time. I did not know the full thing around it until then. So this is that was just me standing around. So now speeding up, speeding up, speeding up, having this guy right here in front of me. It, which is our clan leader right now. If you caught, if you caught his name, it is Lieutenant Vampire. But yeah, he is the clan leader. So if you want to join in the clan, just talk to him, or me, or Taco Man. Okay. Now I'm just standing there because I was told to. <laughs> yeah. But I don't like listening well. So as soon as the round started, and hold on, give a second here, give a second here, and hell with it. Come on. Yeah. Hell with it. Yeah. Hell with that, I'm off it. Come out of here. Shoot. Now, I'm running up here telling him to take the plane. Now, the most epic thing happens here. If you wait to throw your tomahawk by the time you hit the, uh, as soon as the plane takes off, you actually get to see them do that. They will literally chase the plane trying to catch up to you. Which is a pretty fun glitch, but yeah. Now, I shall be covering more zombie info. Just leave comments and stuff below for me to figure out what you want, what you want to know, what you want to see in the future. It doesn't matter. I will do it. I will do my best to do it. But sorry, people, I do not have the technology, technology right now, sadness, to actually make a slideshow. So right now, this is just going off the game for and me speaking over it. All right, now the next thing we need to do. Well, this is just. Uh, a little secret, if you get at least 30 kills with the tomahawk on the bridge, you can actually upgrade it. Upgrade the tomahawk, the, the tomahawk will upgrade to something else. I forgot the name already, one of my friends told me about it, but it, we did not get it to that night. Sadly. Yeah. Oh man, he lied to me. No. What are you? Alright, now, this is just us escaping pure death right here. And I died. I had it after all, I saved it. Now I killed myself, I ran all the way to the jug first before I waited for the next guy to get back, so he yelled at me. And was so really surprised when I told him, hey, I went to, I'm, I'm over here by jug, I can't get to you. What? He's like, what? How did you get over there so fast? But yeah, that's about me, but I'll to get back to the video. Now, the perks I recommend are jug and speed call mainly, and double tap, again, another definite, and then electric cherry. It helps. Now, I thought we had to kill them in the thing, but no, you actually have to go kill them in the shower. This, when you get the acid gat, all you have to do is go kill these guys in the shower until you hear a demonic laugh. You will hear the demonic laugh as soon as you get enough kills. You gotta kill them with the acid gat only, nothing else. But yeah, if you pack a bunch of the, it lures them to it, and yeah. Oh yeah, this is just me slowing it down because my finger got cramped. Okay, but now, yeah, here we go. See, boom. Yeah, it's almost epic kill. Yeah, it's like Skyrim. <laughs> yeah, I'll be doing any games you want me to do either too, but I don't have them all, so just ask me if, just send me a post. And I'll try and get that game and work my best. So yeah, I'll work. I'm, I'm mainly on Black Ops, Black Ops 2. Mainly zombies for me, and we're all, we also do Minecraft videos. I will do how-to videos later on of that, but enough of that. Back to this. Now, once you hear the demonic laugh, this is what you gotta do. As soon as, as, soon as you see me run for the stairs, this is when I got the laugh. Alright, so just give it a sec. Yeah. Now, the reason I ran, because it will hurt you. See, watch. Yep, see? That does hurt even with Jug. It will hurt and almost kill you. That gun is powerful. But I like it. I like it. And a lot of other people are, but the guy next to me, Taco Man, he was really jealous of me that day. He was really, really jealous of me. When we did this. Okay, now see, he just threw his tomahawk, you know. No light. Ow. Kill that zombie. Okay. Now. I'm sorry if my voice sounds quiet to you guys. I tried to project it loud enough for you, but my mic is on a laptop. But now, as soon as you see me run for those stairs, that means we have got the demonic laugh. Which should be right after this next shot. Wait a minute. 
in. Yep, see, there we go. Now, what you want to do next, come over here back to the same bathtub. And then press X if you're playing by yourself, but if you want your friends to get it too, which I did, which we wanted our friends to get it, of course, because it's really helpful. You will press X when they all get here. They all have to press X at the same time. But now, I'm speeding it up so that we can get the third person here. Our fourth person is dead. And now you will see us here, a little musical note, and then you will see a hand raised. And there's your golden spork. Now, this golden spork is a one-hit insta-kill knife until round 33 people. Round 33. Isn't that amazing? Now here's a, here's a little test. This is round 19 and watch me knife looking. Nope, that was already hit, but here, I even have a better example for you right now. Here we go. Here we go, and here comes me knifing. Here it comes, and.